Hi everyone, in this video I want to talk about the differences between GPU and CPU decoding, video decoding. Um, I want to talk about it in this video. In the right side of the screen you simply see the code which is streaming the video via on CPU, decoding the video via on CPU in the right side by using some simple OpenCV libraries. And in the left side is simply showing the code which is decoding the video or decoding the camera stream via on GPU again by simply using OpenCV and CUDA codec libraries compatible with OpenCV. We already installed OpenCV and the other needed libraries in my previous videos. You can check them. And for example, we will use video codec SD key of in NVIDIA. I have an NVIDIA GPU in my computer. So I will use this SD key to reach my GPU to decode video, my video. And in here, documentation is simply saying the decoding available formats in this part. I will simply decoding this simple Tom Jerry video, which is a video codec is H264, which is okay for this SD key. And as you see this video normally uh, 19 minutes 48 second and 24 frames and if you simply calculate many frames inside we will just decoding this video by one by CPU and GPU. Now in the right side let's starting with CPU part. Let's choosing CPU clean all projects and now this code will be compiled and will run and in here we will just make streaming in a while loop and when streaming finish it will break and we will measure the time with high resolution clock of C++ and then we will measure how many milliseconds it will give the result. Let's try this first of all. Now it's starting the streaming as you see in here we will just see when it finished and I wanna make this three times why I wanna make it three times because in each time it will give us different results this is almost 14.8 millisecond 14.8 millisecond plus then let's run one more time because CPU cannot give the same results in each time because of not, can, not focusing only to this program now so better taking average measuring three times and taking average is better than only one result this is also 14.1 14.1 millisecond not millisecond second and the last one is The last one is, as you see, 14.4 millisecond. If we take average, is 14.4 millisecond, not millisecond, second. Let's continue with GPU. This is the previous time I com measured. Let's try. Let's going to that side. Now we will use our GPU to decode the video. Let's start it. Oh, 5.6 second the first time. 5.6 again. And now 5.5. No need to measure. It's almost 5.55 seconds. So as you can see, almost three times more faster than the CPU about decoding. And this is what expected results. Why I want to show this to you because if you have a GPU and if you will make a, if you will make a project about decoding videos, decoding camera streams. For example, about cameras, security cameras generally encoded by H264 codec 
which is uh, so difficult to not so difficult but taking long time to decoding and if you are using GPU to get real time processing you will need to decode via on GPU because CPU cannot catch GPU speed about the decoding of video or also the other processes but in this video I just wanted to show you differences about video decoding GPU and CPU yeah that's all see you in the next videos